So hi friends, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So here in this video, I will talk about the important topic related to Manipal entrance test that is marks versus rank versus your college for the MET 2022. That is Manipal entrance test as you all know the two phase of the examination will be done in the month of May and June. So here I will provide you the safe score for each branch for each campus of Manipal that is Manipal main campus, Bangalore campus and MUJ as well that is Jaipur campus and I will provide you the marks versus expected rank what you can expect in the both phase of the examination of Manipal Interest Test 2022. So if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe to this channel so that you will be getting all the update about Manipal and other entrance exam, other counseling along with the J mains and J advance in the same channel. As you can check, last year I have provided lots of video for Manipal and regularly I have guided lots of students last year particularly for the uh, Manipal Entrance Test and, so, and its counseling that is for the admission process. So if you want at, at that time, you can contact me for that also that is complete counseling guidance using the information available in the description box. So, so basically after watching this video, you will able to set a target for yourself how much marks you should have at least to okay. get the expected branch in a particular campus whatever you are targeting so let's start the video marks versus the... rank versus branch for the MET 2022 so here is MET 2022 safe as code it is marks versus rank versus branch for different campus I will talk here that is after watching you after watching this video you will able to know what is the safe score for you so that you can target according to that and here I will consider marks range from 80 to 200 plus marks as you all know the total marks of Manipal entrance test is 240 marks that is 60 questions that will be combining all three subjects and uh, uh, and it will be of 240 marks that is each question of four marks and if you want to check the detail regarding the examination pattern how is the difficulty level what is the syllabus and how, how you can prepare for that you can watch my previous video that is my MET review 2022 that is everything you need to know about Manipal and, and if you want to check all the thing related to Manipal main campus it is hostel life campus life and all the facilities and a scholarship detail fee structure everything has been discussed in a hardcore video that is Manipal review you can check that video also in the i button as well as the description box so let's get started with the video but before going forward for this video i would like to inform you that this data is applicable for both the phase it is first and second but if there will be dramatic change in the number of students while the second phase i will try to provide you the same video with the with the second phase data as well but as of now you can expect this this data will be valid for both the phases of the examination so here is the detail that is first of all I will talk about marks versus rank and thereafter I will talk about the rank versus your branch in different campus. As you all know this year the examination will be in center last year it was in proctor mode. So this year a little bit number of strength are increased and you can expect a better rank at less marks also because the difficulty of Manipal entrance test is similar to J mains it is not like other entrance exam and the difficulty is quite high so you can expect better uh, rank at less marks also so I have considered everything and last year I've guided lots of students so I know all the marks versus rank data that's why I'm providing you the detail here so first of all if you will talk about 200 plus marks then your rank will be under 200 that is 100% sure and for 180 plus marks your rank will be under uh, 600 and for 170 your plus rank will rank. be under 1.3 thousand and for 160 plus marks your rank will be easily under 2.3 thousand and for 150 plus marks your rank will be uh, under 4000 and for 140 plus marks your rank will be under 6000 and for 120 plus marks your rank will be under 10000 so one more thing i would like to inform you that they will internally calculate the percentile because there will be two attempts and there will be multiple shift in that two attempts so different, different shift will have different type of question level and different type of strength will also appear in it so they will do the normalization internally they will provide the percentile as the result after the first attempt but after the second attempt they will consider the best percentile if you will appear in both the examination then they will consider the best percentile among the, among the two attempt of your examination and uh, according to the best percentile they will provide you the rank similar to J means you can relate this that is internally they will calculate the percentile and you will also get the percentile so uh, 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 what will be the percentile I will try to provide you that data also that is marks versus your percentile what you can expect so that video I will try to provide you uh, uh, once uh, the examination will be done so that you can easily relate those data with your uh, with your marks whatever, whatever you will know. expect in the examination so next if you will talk about for uh, 100 marks your rank will be under 19,000 and for 80 plus your rank will be under 30,000 and if you will uh, score less than that then I don't think you will be interested in taking the admission in Manipal because you will not get the best branch. So uh, now, now I will talk I... about the rank versus the branch for different campus which is Manipal main campus. Bangalore campus as you all know from last year included in Manipal college that is Bangalore campus is also now available for the admission for BTEC course and there is also MUJ uh, is that is Jaipur Manipal. campus. So now I will talk about that 
but before that there is total two phase of the examination as i already discussed first will be in the may that is 14 15 and 16 and, and second will be in june that is 9 10 and 11 and third phase is for mtech admission so you don't need to think about that you need to day. appear in any of the two attempt or you can attempt the both uh, both phase of the examination as well whatever you want you can do i will suggest go for both the phase so that the best will be considered for the result so before so, moving forward for this video i would like to inform you that at the time of counseling if you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box for complete counseling guidance that is well, that is how, you, uh, how you need to do the counseling in order to get the best out of your rank so everything i will be discussing with you and not only for manipal but for other but for counseling other... also including josa and cseb that is for jmens and advanced and other counseling such as ipali vit bitset all the counseling that that you will do this year up to your final admission will be done i will be guiding with you after talking with you and if possible with your parents as well so if you want you can contact me and now also you can contact me for the mentorship program that is how you need to do the preparation for different type of entrance exam including JE mains and J advanced so if you want you can contact me anytime through instagram or whatsapp number so that i will be discussing everything with you from now up to your admission is done so now let's talk about the rank versus your branch that you can expect in main campus bangalore campus and jaipur campus so for cse in main campus your ranks would be your rank should be under 800 and for Bangalore your rank, rank should be under 5.5 thousand but if your rank will be little bit more than this then also you can expect but you have to do the counseling very carefully because Manipal counseling is a, a little bit different because it here is not like not lots of Australian will be there yeah, here number of Australian will be less but you need to be a smart while doing the counseling process because it is it is new to every student you do the preparation for the examination but counseling required experience and that I will provide to you because I am guiding the uh, student from last so many years so that's why I will provide you everything once you register with my guidance program. So, so now I would like to introduce the Philo app where you can get the solution of all your question, doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to J or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is first you have to download the Philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app. And after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the India's best educator. In question you want to say that bulb ki power is if bulb is 220 voltage per operator hai, right this battery ka jo voltage hai wo aapko given hai 220 to ye aapko simple relation ho gaya yahan par ab agar koi aapko aur doubt hai to bataiye so without wasting your time download the philo app link is available in the description box and use the code ieb001 you will get the 10% instant discount and, and for uh, jaipur campus you can expect the csc up to 13000 as well it is the main core csc branch and for csc specialization you can get up to 3000 in the main campus and for Bangalore campus, you can get up to 15,000 and for Jaipur, you can get it up to 20,000. As you all know, there are lots of uh, CSE specialization courses are available in the uh, all campus of the uh, Manipal that is cyber security, AI, ML. So all those uh, specialization will be available up to the rank, whatever I have discussed now. So now let's talk about for EC. If for main campus, you can get up to 5,000 and if your rank will be around 5.5 or 6,000, then also you can expect because year by year number of seats are increasing and for Bangalore campus up to 22,000 for MUJ that is Jaipur campus up to 24,000 you can expect so this year the counseling will be done I think a little bit earlier because last year the counseling was done so late but this year I think they will do the counseling earlier so you can expect better uh, better branch at less uh, at lower rank as well because there will be less number of students who will participate in the counseling process because they they uh, they may aim for the JOSA or CSEP counseling as well so for IT branch, you can get up to 2000 rank in main campus for Bangalore 14,000 for Jaipur 18,000 and for Tripoli e, that is available in main campus only up to 10,000 you can get and for other branches it is uh, mechanical, chemical, civil or any other branches you can get up can to 35,000 in the main campus and in Bangalore there is no other other branches than whatever I have discussed and for uh, Jaipur campus you can expect up to 35 and up to 40,000 uh, also you can get any type of branch that is other than the branch that I have discussed now. So this is all about the marks versus rank versus branch for Manipal entrance test 2022. So hope you find this video very useful. So please try to subscribe to the channel so that you will get all the update in the future days as well. And try to share this video to your friends so that they can also get this information. So thanks again for watching this video. Please try to subscribe.